Today we are going to continue acting out word problems, but yesterday we were finding the number of items in equal groups. In today's problem, we're going to practice finding out how many equal groups. Let's take a look at this first problem. Lisa has 16 tacos. She wants to give each of her friends four tacos. How many friends will get tacos? So in this problem, we're trying to find out how many friends will get tacos. So I'm going to write down blank friends will get tacos. Now let's go back and reread and see what we know for sure. Lisa has 16 tacos. Okay, so she has 16 tacos. And she wants to give each of her friends four tacos. So each person is getting four tacos. How many friends will get tacos? Well, let's see. Today I'm going to use pennies to act out this problem. So I have 16 pennies already counted out. And I'm going to put these in groups of four because each person is going to get four tacos. So person one is going to get one, two, three, four tacos. And I can see there's enough tacos to give another person some tacos. So here's person two, one, two, three, four tacos. And it looks like we have enough to give a third person four tacos. One, two, three, four. And it looks like we still have tacos to give away. So here's person number four. One, two, three, four tacos. So I can see that there is one, two, three, four people and each person is getting one, two, three, four tacos. So four friends will get four tacos. Now, just like yesterday, I can write an equation to represent this problem. We started out with 16 people, and today we divided them into groups of four. And when we did that, we ended up with four groups. So we have 16 tacos divided into groups of four, which left us with four people or four groups getting tacos.